What's going on, everybody? It's your boy Childish. We're back at it again with the next epic fail Guild Wars. Uh, yeah, buddy. <laughs> I'm super excited. As uh, if you guys remember, this is one of the teams that we fought, I think, about a week or two ago, and um, we were kind of close on the on the mark when it comes to Source. We tried to play it safe, and now we just found out that we won it. So, as you might have guessed, um, the their number one guy <clears throat> that had the interesting team on the right. Um, we're going, so we're definitely going to go ahead and battle him, but let's go ahead and get some other swords out of the way, just in case, um, you know, we have any issues down the road, so I, uh, took a look at a couple teams, I think I'm going to start with Timmy, Timmy Lee up in here, um, and again, we're going to go ahead and, uh, you know, just have fun with it, and hopefully, um, you know, you, if we're going to use some people that are not the norm or whatever, we're going to do it with, uh, we're going to do it with units that are not going to affect that last fight so we can have fun and check it out. Um, so, yeah, let me go. Uh, one of the weird, weird YOLO um, teams that I've been playing around with uh, lately has been this. Um, you guys have seen it a couple times. Uh, Jewel Town lead. Then we got ourselves um, Hua. And Hua is set up with a lot of uh, speed, crit damage, and crit rate. So she can hold her own. And then, of course, uh, a cleanser here. Um, I think it's one of those things that is just going to have to be used. I think we're going to go, what we're going to do on that first one is go for, uh, the light, I'm sorry, light fail. The fire archangel, I want to take away its ability to provide the immunity. In addition, uh, because the other beast monks are, uh, units that will heal the unit, uh, if he, uh, if he has, uh, uh, what is it called? If he has the, uh, if he's low on hit points or whatnot, so we're going to try to force the heal while the hit point disturb is on the particular unit. Now, of course, that could all go to go out the, just not work if he's on will. I do not remember if he was on will, so we're gonna go ahead and uh, run it and hope for the best, and then we'll adjust on the fly. So again, um, this is a fail. <laughs> this is a, uh, this is a, what's it called? This is the end of, what's it called? I'm trying to think. Yeah, it's the end of a raid, so we can be a little bit more crazy with our teams. Um, definitely, definitely going to be a little bit of a struggle now. We're just hoping for some big hits on Hua. Gosh, you got to you gotta talk about that clutch, man. Um, it, does, it doesn't get much better than that. It doesn't get much better than that. So let's go ahead and see what we can do right now. I think either one could be... Uh, Detrimental, but I feel that the that the beast monk is probably going to be the bigger damage dealer here. So let's go ahead and hit him up. <clears throat> uh oh, they're going for him. They're going for him. So, but now we got the opportunity to get some stuns in. This is exactly what I want. Um, we got the defense break on, hit point disturbs on, and the unit is knocked out. So with any luck over here, we'll be able to save Veramos. Uh, hopefully it. Uh, it works out as we want it, and I think we are in the clear. There you go. Yeah, buddy. All right, so we 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 eked it out. We eked it out. Going for the uh, going for the one chat. Let's see if we can uh, just force the uh, fallen blossoms here, and maybe get lucky on the. Ooh, nope, nope, nope. We didn't get it. We didn't get it. Um, but we're we're doing good because uh, he decided to go for Orion. I'm okay with that as long as he doesn't go beast mode. And uh, we lose him. I, I kind of wanted to use him in the uh, in a prior match, so we'll see. Yeah, buddy. All right. So let's go ahead and auto this one. Nothing else to do. Uh, if we lose this one, we are in trouble. But obviously, <laughs> there's no more kill threat. So we should be all right. We should be all right. I'm super excited to, to start uh, doing guild battles again. As you guys know, I... Recently went out to uh, Cali and uh, just got back, so, or I'm on the process of heading back, but by the time you see this, I'll probably be back at my residence, so I'm excited to start uh, raiding again because I took a week off um, from raids just to focus on everything that we need to do down in Cali, so uh, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see if we can find a plus two out there. Oh, actually, I remember this team. We fought them a while back, so let's see if we can do something else here. Um, oh, you know what? You know what? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's, um... I actually... 
actually want to go ahead and do it. I'm trying to see if... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. So, um, I think this is one of those... This is one of those setups where I might be able to get away. We're gonna go. We're gonna get a little crazy. We're gonna get a little crazy. All right. Let's. We're gonna go with. Um, we're gonna go with Theo. Theo was the lead, and then I actually ruined up the Kung Fu girl. Notice the uh, Zhao Lin. I've always. I know you guys uh, love to see different units. Uh, we got him on a uh, Vampire Blade. Uh, yes, you did hear that, Vampire Blade. I'm just using the extra runes that I got. I had these runes sitting around, not doing anything, so I might as well um, use it so you guys can kind of see where the stats are at. I'm, I'm, I'm getting, you know what I'm saying, I'm, I'm, I'm at the position where I'm trying to work different units in when I can, um, but then trying to get all my, all my units synergized around that, you know, 145 to 150 range, and I just realized that with the runes that I had, I was able to get that done with her, and uh, because she has that um, built-in counterattack and the ability to stun on the, on the third skill, I think she can be a nice little unit to play around with. So uh, let's take a look. Hopefully, hopefully this. Um, actually, we shouldn't have any issues. We're gonna go yellow here uh, with my with the speed that I have on Orion. Uh, it's just about so we're, our, our our damage healers are just about forty percent. Or sorry, they're just about 70% of the speed, so it should work really well. We're going to use a full-blown water team here. And where is she? Where's she hiding? Where's she hiding? Yeah, buddy. All right, YOLO this stuff. We're going to rock it. And then down below, um, we'll go ahead and... Because some of the units that I want to use in the, in the last fight, uh, i got to go ahead and get it done. So we'll probably... Gosh, I'm trying to think here. The hit point disturb. Ugh. We haven't done Jubel in a while, right? We haven't done Jubel in a while. And Darian, unfortunately, he's not ruined. Let's go ahead and actually, could we do it again? Could we do that? Can we do that, uh, Jultan team? Or are we gonna have issues because of the the fact that they're um, Veramos is, you know, be able to take out the things. So let's, you know what? Let's get crazy with it. Um, the units that I want to use are, are going to be okay. You know, obviously with the defense breaks and whatnot, we might, we might get in a little bit of trouble depending on who Jultan hits. But with, um, Veramos with a good amount of speed on the speed leader, um, you know, we, we should be able to cleanse those right away. Hopefully the defense break, uh, hopefully his team's not synergized to the point where we're having a, a big, big issue here. So it looks like we got ourselves a nice um, jump. And I probably should have gone for the uh, the other unit here. It looks like we went ahead and knocked them out. Worked out pretty good. Probably should have gone for Laika just to secure the kill and force him to, you know, force him to die and play the 2v3. Theo can obviously uh, wreck it, <laughs> but uh, we want to go ahead and we want to go ahead and get it done. So this works really good. Uh, right now, I'll definitely play around with this in the offense. Um, you know, the reason being Theo Mars crit lead, 24%. Uh, As you guys saw, we had uh, Zhao Lin. I don't know how you pronounce that, but I hope that's right. You know, correct me if I'm wrong there. At 77%, so that puts her at 100 crit rate. And then, of course, Orion um, sitting there with um, the harmful effects that we want in addition to an AoE defense break. So if we get the opportunity to violent proc, after the harmful effect goes on and get the AOE defense break, then we get the opportunity to use Zhao Lin and uh, take advantage of a third skill with defense breaks on everybody, right? Yeah, buddy. All right. So again, we're going to try to slow this one down a little bit um, if we can. I think I think the immunities is what's going to play the, the biggest role here. Uh, I feel good about this. I think we got it. Once we get one unit down, it's pretty much GG. Gonna leave. Uh, gonna go ahead and leave. Uh, actually, now now we're in that we're in that scenario where, what are we gonna do, right? Because we know that he's gonna heal. He's gonna heal uh, Jultan. Maybe we get lucky and we get the uh, stun. If we get a violent proc, no, he didn't heal Jultan. Did I miss that? Did I miss the? Um, 
Uh, I don't know if I used it already or whatever. That's okay. I'm going to have to check. Obviously, I guess he did, so... The good thing is, though, we should be, unless he goes crazy with the violent procs, the overall speed of my team and the attack gauge reduction should be enough to get it done. Looks like it is. Um, yeah, buddy. All right. Got it down. Got it down. Okay, last but not least, the one and only Rugosa. Let's see if we can get it done. Uh, I forgot what I did with the first team. Let's go ahead and throw, like, three random people here, and let's see what we're going to do for the second one. Um... It's kind of weird. Like, I kind of want to, you know, Theo is so strong, um, and we know that he's going to do some, some, some band damage, right? He's going to, he's going to, he's going to knock one out the park. Um, I think I'm going to have to go with one of the subscribe, subscribers that, that made the comment here. Um, they made a valid point that while this one is uh, fire and he's going to do a lot if I bring basically a, like a full blown yellow team with auto with, um, with the, uh, what's it called, with the uh, water, we should be okay. So what I'm gonna go ahead and do um, is probably do something like this. Um, I think Chandra would work really good here too, probably the better choice. Um, but I want to, I want to have, I want to have the opportunity to kind of compete with his attack gauge um, buff. And then of course, you know, I think Theo just needs to be in there just to help out with the DPS. Um, I do like, I do like my original team with Veramos in there. Technically, that would be okay too. But again, um, I think I think we need to have just a little bit of damage. Uh, you know, given the situation, if we do get lucky on the Orion with a defense break and then push Steel's thing, uh, if we get the opportunity to secure a win on either um, the Dark uh, Sylvia there or or Vertihill, that'll kind of secure the win if we get that two v three going. As long as we can cripple him right away with that one shot. Uh, Veramos, the combination of Veramos, uh, Orion, and and Tyron gets the job done as far as the CC goes. But um, sometimes I can't get the damage I want. And then they buy the proc and, and get it you know, get it out the way. So let's go with that. Uh, up top, can't really, whoops, can't really rely on speed. Uh, because we have ourselves little Mr. Leo. But let's go ahead and see if we can mix it up. Get ourselves one of our, let's see. We do something like this to force the, uh... they really, they're really kind of yellow, aren't they, huh? Huh. Let me see, let me see. Kind of want to play with Leica. And I, if I remember correctly, um, oh man, I don't I don't remember this this particular team here. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Mm, whoops. I wish I, it's so funny, I'm looking at Leo and I'm like, I wish I had the, uh, I wish he didn't manipulate the speed. I kind of want to bring somebody in for the attack boost, attack bar boost, but um, yeah. We'll see, we don't have anybody, well, we do have this one that can do the buff removal. I guess let's go ahead and bring a healer. We're going to have an issue with uh, Jubel going for Bella, but it's all good. Hoping to get that one shot out the way uh, with Laika. Let's see if we can make it do what it do. Since we don't use Leica all that much. Alright. Let's see if we can get it going. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, he, he missed that. He missed that. There it is. Got him. Now, did I miss something? Oh, yes, I did. Okay, so the attack bar um, change on... Uh, what is it? Um, on the Corona, right? I had, I had the Leo hit him, and I lost 10% of my attack bar, so... Even though my Corona has more speed than Leica, I completely forgot that he did that, so I lost the opportunity to buff, uh, you know, buff it out. So, all right. 
And then here we go, final match. Let's go ahead and get it going, let them finish up here. Now I'm assuming his lovely, lovely uh, Vertihill is fast. Oh no, that is definitely what we don't want to have happen. Oh my gosh, you got to be kidding me. <laughs> you got to be kidding me. Um, yeah, buddy, can we... Uh, Let's see, can we get the little defense break before this? Oh no. Wow, 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 wow. Okay, well let's get this guy out the way. All right, all right, slow, oh, oh. slow it down. Slow it down. Ah, you know what? I really, I mean, I think I still got this, but I should have definitely gone for Sylvia, I think, just cause she has, uh, just cause I can take her out without the Endure or whatever, but Looks like we got it done, guys. No big deal. I guess uh, last time around, got a little bit, a uh, little bit more afraid of what this particular unit can do. The notes that I had on um, uh, on Vertihill was that he is faster than 274 speed from one of our uh, previous uh, members. Lego last did the notes on that. Um, so yeah, definitely, I definitely knew that I was gonna lose that first round uh, as far as speed goes, but. Looks like we were fortunate enough to secure the win. So again, guys, great tip to kind of throw in there. If you are in a uh, guild that's looking to progress in the G1 to G2 and G2 to G3, um, and you are sitting there in, in a place where you're constantly fighting uh, people that you see time and time and again, it is definitely beneficial to go ahead and take some notes and uh, and then put those in a uh, chat channel, maybe a separate channel for raid-only notes. It's something that we do to help us progress in the last part of the week when we find challenging people. Taking notes on partic particular fights, finding out if uh, a particular team has something that is not typically a custom. So, like this right team, you know, this team on the left here, round two, you know, we might take a note if uh, if a particular unit is slower or faster than a particular speed uh, of a unit that we bring. Um, if a unit is uh, generally not on violent but is on violent, or if a unit provides uh, or has a will, has a will set, because obviously immunity. Uh, first turn immunity is a big, big thing. It is end game content there that you want to go ahead and watch out for. So yeah, just any and all notes that you can help improve. Uh, uh, you know the people that fight it in the future. That's definitely um, you know definitely a nice tool to go ahead and throw in there. So again, guys, thank you all for tuning in. I hope you like this uh, style of the Guild Wars. Uh, I do apologize that I uh, don't have it set up with the face cam or whatever. Um, the the uh, device that I use for the face cam is um, the uh, one that I bought from my wife, and of course she is uh, she is at home right now, or she is uh, at home at, at our home right now, and I'm still out of town, so I'm just using my phone to record this. Alrighty, that is it. I am done. Shaboy Childish, Childish Place, checking out. Yeah, take care. We'll see you next time, guys. We're out.